There's really no reason to overthink most of the items on McDonald's menu. Those salty, hot, and crisp french fries in their fire engine red carton have looked and tasted the same since your childhood. The same could be said of their burgers. From the understated hamburger to the jacked-up Big Mac, Mickey D's has come to define the prototype for what a fast-food burger should taste like. Every now and then, McDonald's will introduce a new menu item that generates buzz. But for the most part, going to the Golden Arches is a break for your brain when you just want to eat. Except, can we talk about the McDonald's filet fish sandwich? This McDonald's institution raises more questions than it answers, especially when it comes to its half-cheese slice. Putting aside the question, why is there cheese on my fish sandwich? An even more pressing question is, why did someone cut the cheese slice on my fish sandwich in half? For years, McDonald's customers have gotten angry when they inspected their filet fish sandwiches, mistakenly believing they'd been shorted a full cheese slice. But McDonald's has always provided only half a slice. This is not to save cost, but to save flavor. The full slice of the American cheese would overpower the mild, delicate flavor of the lightly breaded Alaskan Pollock patties McDonald's claims. In case you're wondering, and we're sure you were, McDonald's used to use cotter haddock, but you're eating Alaskan Pollock today. A larger question, however, may be why anyone is putting cheese on a fish sandwich in the first place. Give me back that filet fish Give me that fish Give me back that filet fish Give me that fish Whether you love or hate cheese on your fried fish sandwich, the fact remains that a slice of processed American cheese is going to add calories and fat to your lunch. So if health is a concern, perhaps going halvesies on the cheese is a good thing? According to McDonald's website, the filet fish has 380 calories and 18 grams of fat. Other fast-food restaurants serving fried fish sandwiches pack a bigger caloric wallop. Culver's North American Cod Sandwich has 600 calories and 33 grams of fat. Meanwhile, White Castle's cheese top panko sliders, which are small, meaning many people eat more than one, have between 340 and 350 calories, depending upon the type of cheese, and between 22 and 23 grams of fat. Of course, if the calorie count is at the top of your mind and you want a sandwich with cheese, the filet fish option isn't your best bet at McDonald's. After all, a plain cheeseburger has only 300 calories and 13 grams of fat. As CNBC reported, the filet fish actually has the most calories per bite, assuming that a single bite equals an ounce. Each mouthful of cheesy fish will cost you 78 calories. That said, each time you sink your teeth into a hamburger, you'd be chewing on just 68.6 calories. The outlet concluded, If you're counting calories, don't just look at the nutritional value. You'll also want to consider how many calories you're getting per bite. Let's say you're not really that concerned about calories. You are eating at McDonald's after all. Even if that's true, you should order the filet fish without the cheese. This isn't to save yourself calories or fat grams, because let's be honest, the fried breading on the fish is what's making this Lent time favorite a dietary indulgence, not that little remnant of American cheese. Rather, McDonald's regulars have reported that the request for a cheese-free filet fish will force the fast food joint to make your sandwich fresh. According to the money-saving blog Clark.com, if you are really craving that half slice of cheese, you can instead politely ask the McDonald's employee working behind the counter for a cook to order filet fish Two filet fish please. The sandwich should take about five minutes to make, and since you ordered it off the menu, you can rest assured that your filet fish will come out hot and fresh. However, you'll only know for certain that they heeded this request if you ask that they omit the cheese, seeing as the sandwiches are pre-assembled with the tartar sauce, cheese, and other toppings already in place. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more MASH videos about your favorite fast food are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.